In October 1983, the K-324 went out on its first patrol, one element of which was to track the U.S. frigate McCloy FF-1038, which was testing the towed array surveillance system TAS, hydroacoustic antenna. The frigate released the antenna to its maximum length. The antenna cable wrapped around the propeller of the K-324, and the submarine stopped moving. However, the frigate never detected the K-324 and left for base. In the morning, K-324 was spotted by a Canadian aircraft. Two U.S. Navy destroyers later approached the scene of the accident. With a strong desire to retrieve the secret antenna, the Americans tried an exotic method. The nuclear-powered submarine USS Philadelphia approached K-324 underwater and snagged the cable with its hull. For more than a week the atmosphere was heated to the extreme. A few days later, the salvage vessel Alden towed the submarine to Cuba. The submarine returned home and was in the fleet until 2000 and then scrapped.